Hello, my name is Ben, and I'm one of the users at 10% Credit Spreads. Um, I've been with Austin since he ran um, IS2 and Pickle Software, and now I've joined him at 10% Credit Spreads. Um, I think this is a fantastic strategy. It's a very easy strategy to follow. There are plenty, plenty of tickers uh, to choose from. There are plenty of uh, ideas that are generated almost daily that you can choose from. Um, I think this is a fantastic program for those who have a full-time job. I have a full-time job. I can in the markets, and yet... Um, Whenever I get a trade alert, I can enter almost immediately. Putting in the trade takes me about a minute. Um, even if I miss that initial entry, I can oftentimes get in at a later date, either the next day on a pullback, you may even get a better, slightly better entry. And I think that the risk and reward is very defined, both reward and risk are defined. And so you know exactly what you're getting into, you know exactly what your risk is. And so I think it's a very easy way and a very um, reassuring way to generate consistent returns. And uh, the only thing really to you is manage the trade as it goes along, especially if it's getting to your um, close to your strike price to where you might generate a loss. Um, that's really the only thing you have to do is manage those. But in general, you can set these and pretty much forget these. Um, and so as we look at the, um, this is a snapshot of the landing page. And so you can see here a couple of things you see. There's a Discord page, which we'll talk about, um, Roadmap to Success PDF and Credit Spreads Training, um, which is also part of the Masterclass Library. Um, where you anything you need to know about credit spreads if you've never done these before they're very easy to do they're very easy to put in and uh Austin has done a great job teaching you about what those what credit spreads are as well as all various different brokers that people use that uh, obviously every platform is and so he goes through exactly how to put in the orders on those platforms but um even if you get stuck or lost uh the discord as you can see here is a very active uh Austin himself is in and out constantly throughout the day he has specific office hours but he's actually present pretty much throughout the day. And so if you have any questions, um, you can always engage with him or other members are also uh, very helpful. Um, so you can get questions about the credit spreads themselves, how to put the entries um, or market sentiment as we have some advanced uh, traders on that. This, this was one, not necessarily one of the advanced ones, but there are some people who are more knowledgeable. Um, and as you can see here, we have the dashboard, which is kind of the page we're on. You see a few of the tickers down here, but there are also GLD um, and the QQQ um, and SPY are also some of the tickers I have SPX showing since you do fewer trades and get um in order to get you know, the return that you're looking for since SPY that times it says in SPY. Um and then when we go to the trades tracker, um, you can see some of my performance. So this is my performance thus far. Uh, initially I was trading smaller sizes as I got started getting used to the program. I started uh, increasing my size and you can see here. Um but in general, average return per trade is 7.1%. It's kind of my own doing. I think you can get closer to 10% to some of the earlier trades that close a little too early. Um, so I think it's definitely possible to get closer to that 10% return. Uh, average trade length is about 11 days. So like I said, this is not, um, you don't have to be day trading it. You can do it with a full time job earlier. Trade accuracy, 89.5%. So as of this uh, total close trades, I had 19 and two of them were losers. And one of them was actually, so I think that percent accuracy can actually be a little bit. And as you can see, these are the open trades that I have currently. And I think at this point, they should all close for a while. So um, I'm very pleased with this so far. So I think this is a great uh, way to set it up for get it kind of trades. Um, I think this is dedicate a chunk of your income, your trading account rather, um, to this strategy. And I think even as your account size grows, you may be able to make this a primary strategy and then take your shots with some of the other strategies that you might be able to but um, as you can see, that it's a very high win rate. Uh, the only thing you really have to do is manage them. If they do get start getting closer to your strike price, which is not particularly common or often. Um, and um, like I said, as long as you manage those well, um, I think this is a very viable strategy. I think it's an excellent strategy and um, very appreciated in Boston. And um, uh, to see you all there.